not working. I'm doing, I'm doing, okay, I'm doing two videos a day for this week. This week. Um, this is new horror game. It's probably scarier than the other one I played, like, a few minutes ago. But, uh, what do we do? No threats. Seven nights total. Permadeath means. Uh, no permadeath. Five total. Casual spoons. Casual. I guess we'll do casual, because I don't really know too much. When she was a kid, Luna aspired to be a superhero. Not the ones in skin-tight suits that could fly, but the ones that identified connections where others didn't. She wanted X-ray vision to observe criminals when they tried to hide from the law, and supersonic hearing to listen in on mischievous talks, then a measure of heightened strength to restrain the guys bigger than her. This was all she craved when she was a child. As she became older, her ambitions took a more realistic approach which seemed in direct opposition to the surreal tone the news took. The facts became the new dystopian fiction. The world grew louder each year, apparently more violent or more visible than the year before. Her generation grew up looking to cull the increasingly violent trends that saw mass incarcerations, drug wars, and serial killers studying to gain notoriety. Luna took the analytical route in her quest for justice feeling more at home processing case files, evidence, and connecting dots. Her cousin, a sister almost, enrolled in the academy and became an officer of the law. Even extended family, no matter how far away, seemed to gravitate towards law enforcement, almost as if it were in their blood. A murderer becomes a serial killer with just two more kills, a co-worker informed her over scones and coffee one morning. This one had three total that day. But that number hit double digits soon enough, accumulating corpses of officers, criminal lawyers, and several field investigators to a growing pile of victims. The news on TV, becoming more unreal as the years ticked on by, ran the Blue Blood Killer story 24-7. Luna knew about the local serial killer, more so than most thanks to all the overtime spent processing corroborative evidence for their many crimes. However, it still felt more like gossip and fabricated plot points. At least, until that phone call made something so artificial an actuality. The call came in the middle of the night, as unexpected as a bullet in the dark. Her cousin, the exemplar of a police officer, had been killed. It was just the tragically common traffic stop gone wrong, or armed robber with a weighted pistol. Maybe Luna could have mourned and pushed on, but it wasn't any run-of-the-mill incident that was so characteristic of headlines. No, it wasn't that because life had long turned into a phantasmagoric nightmare. Officer Sarah Youngman, revered by all that mattered, died at the hands of the Blue Blood Killer. Who he was, or who they were, remained an enigma despite their murder spree eroding through states, counties, and homes. But more than the long list of confirmed victims and possible connections Luna herself had registered and slept away, this monster killed Sarah. Somehow, that turned the boogeyman into a living, breathing threat. No longer was this tyrant a thing she filed at the end of the day. It wasn't an obsession of the media. He was here, and if not in the literal sense, then definitely in her mind. This realization gnawed at her for months after the real morning faded. Luna's acceptance stage barely registered before she fell swiftly to anger once again, and it never genuinely went away. Luna craved a name. She wanted to know who killed the sweetest woman in the world despite so-called dirty cops walking free. Luna needed justice. 
What was it about her cousin that triggered this killer in the first place? Could it be that she stood for everything a cop should be? A perfect example of morality, protectiveness, mentality, and heart? Officer Youngman was everything demanded in the ones that protected them. And Luna wouldn't allow her memory to fade away as another statistic. Day in and day out, she spent the connection she'd built up through work and rowdy Christmas parties to see if there was something no one else saw. Cop friends that never steered her wrong came up empty-handed. Family members with careers linked closer to the real action knew little else than the papers. Even the old-timers that knew things few else did all but shrugged when she pressed them for clues. She needed leads first, but there were none. So, in a last-ditch effort, she resolved to chew her boss for leeway. Luna did all she could for any little morsel of information, regardless of the fallout. Being an investigations analyst for the district attorney's office had its perks, but it only teased her for all the good it did with building an idea of who this killer was. Her boss knew what she was after, but he followed the rules as strictly as Luna did. Being shut down by him just meant there was one less layer between a law-abiding citizen and vigilante justice. With each denied application for information outside her classification, Luna saw the justice system's holes appear and broaden. Sometimes the law hindered what mattered. Progress couldn't always continue behind red tape and protocol. Perhaps, in cases like these, rules were meant to be budged. Maybe she couldn't talk her way into databases and case folders. Maybe it wasn't so easy as to read reports on other victims, hoping a eureka moment hit her. If she were going to make any change, it had to start with her, with citizens willing to help. Yes, Luna respected the law, and she would uphold it as Sarah would have wanted, but she couldn't stand idly by any longer. One morning, she called in sick, made flyers, and pinned them around town. She started a neighborhood watch that day, and by the next day at work, Luna couldn't think of anything else. It started with one report, then two, then three and four, and more. Before she realized what was happening, her small network of retired cops and nosy neighbors had become a full-on crime watch program that spanned beyond the neighborhood, the suburbs, and into town. At times, the number of reports felt too much for one person. But for the hundreds of thousands of people less prepared for human horrors as Sarah was, Luna felt that a couple of sleepless nights was the least she could do. Luna had to get her answers somehow. Okay. After that friggin' long cutscene, Freaking seven minutes. I don't like jump scares. Turn them off in the options menu. Okay. Nah, we we taken the we taken the jump scares. That's why we're here, isn't that? Game. Night one. What's this? I Five should get to my computer and get the I night started. What's this? Five nights at Freddy's. Oh. Yeah, look. Oh. Can I lock? I don't lock him. I don't lock him. Oh. Is it bathroom? I guess we have to check every window. I didn't really read the rules, but... Oh, that's... I watched a video on the rules. I think the rules in this game are too long. Did I get this? Yeah, I got that.
that they hide. We'll know that they're in there. Okay. So the blue blood killer. I can't see. Oh, it's... I think you gotta flash the lights of cameras and keep all the lights and stuff on. Wait, how do I... How do I do the lights? Oh, it's space. Okay. Port desk. Oh. So this is like... Anthony Hopkins. With all these. Um. Oh, that's the evidence. So. It doesn't really tell us... Wait. How do I... Oh, that's how, okay. Left click. I just want to make sure everything is fine. Let me check all the rooms. Because you gotta keep all the lights on. Okay. Just making sure, because I heard something. I don't know if it was outside or... So, records, name, and then Hawks. I thought it said Hawkins. No police record found. Okay. Damn it. Spot that wrong. Search. I don't think there's anything. Oh, let's check the cameras. Sim, step it, port desk. Oh, that's we open that. Records. What? 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 What was that noise? I don't know what I just heard. Can we go see, um... All oh, the lights are on. Thank you. Yeah, you gotta make sure... I think that's what that noise was. The lights were off. Okay. We gotta go quick. We, we haven't done any work. We gotta get four or one. I don't know. Uh, I don't really know. How do I?
think this one was a false. Oh, it was correct. Check the cameras. Female, 20 to 25. How do I get social spy? Name or allies? Winter. No internet connection. Let's close all that. Cause... So does that mean we have to go to the router? This is the router. Check all the doors. and paste her name. Can I do that? No. Copy. So I can do so it's uh I don't think there's anything wrong. Put the name over here. Oh, it does work. Well, let's go. We can do that. No police record file. We could do that so much faster. Excuse me, I burped, but you probably didn't hear it. Oh. She'll see. this in here. And check the cameras. I think that's what that is. They can just barge in my house. here. Okay. So... So free drama... Nothing wrong here. Pictures. Okay. Just some babies. Nothing... I don't think... The prop bodies at your house for a few weeks?
I don't think anything is wrong. Get up. I heard something. I gotta make sure everything is fine. Because... Oh! Yeah, see that? Oh, all the lights are off. You gotta click it twice. Jeez. So I think she did nothing. She 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 didn't do it. Yes. Okay, so we just need one of one of these. So let's get one. Hold on. Huh? Bro, what? What? I can't see anything. Do I have a flashlight? Oh, I do have a flashlight! Why isn't it working? Why isn't it working? That's not cool. I freaking. Yeah, make sure everything is fine. I thought it was over. Like someone was in my house and then he killed me. Can I just read this? Caleb Butler. Please get the little creep off my back. Okay. okay. I heard something. I heard. Bro. Who keeps turning? Turn on the light. Who keeps turning on my light? Or off? Yup. I got a light with off. Okay, everything. Wait, I gotta check this room. Is this room alright? Yeah, it's good. Oh, I don't, I don't like that. Those footsteps are ugly. So. Can I just please just get through this? Okay, so name. Oh, we do actually have a police report. Evidence. They do say, like, all the... So, he's about, like, 20 to 30. Should we just put 20? Oh, it's like that. Okay. Height. Five. I don't know what that noise is. Uh. One fifty. Gender male. 
and then flip around and then What does that mean? Check camera. Okay, nobody's here. Actually Oh, so you look like this. Okay, let's put that there. What the? Bro. Did I see somebody out there? That's my mailbox. I gotta check a house, like. Multiple times. I heard a footstep. This game, bro. Check cameras. Check them. Nobody's here. So, is this enough? Get his like what's that? I, I don't know what that sound is. What is that town? We got that. I think we got everything. So we can put that there. Oh, that was wrong. That was wrong. Don't worry, we'll, we can probably try again. has no name. Hold on. Cameras. I'm checking the house one more time. Maybe not one more time, but I gotta check the house. I heard like a little like sad or whatever. Gotta make sure everything is alright. We're fine. What does that mean? What does that sound mean? What is... Does something happen? I gotta check one more time. Oh, that was... Okay, I was like... Was that something? I don't know what that sound is. So, we don't really have the name. Again? Stop 
I'm doing that. I'm trying to do my work. So it's cool that we do have a flashlight. I'm trying to do my work though. So let's just get the uh let's just get this off the straight. So age thirty to fifty. Okay. So this dude must be a grown man. So it's just six. That's it. We is no two hundred and thirty. There isn't a two hundred thirty. But the set. No. It's just gender man. Hair cut hair color red and then blue eyes. I like blue. Now, I, now I gotta do that. I keep forgetting what the buttons are. We gotta wait here until it's good. Okay, everything's fine. So let's try now. Wait, what was his name? Oh, we, we don't really have the name. But yep, this looks like the record. So, the name is... <laughs> what just happened, though? We didn't do anything. I didn't even beat the night. Why are you, like, congratulating? Yeah, I close all the windows, too. That's our, that's our sister. these these ones are this one is in the on the seems to be everything. Let's go get this. Cameras. I don't know what how this dude be showing up. Okay, well, let's get the desk report. <laughs> Yo! They literally put my name in the game? Seriously? Yo. I'd be crazy if... I'll check the cameras. Wait, we don't know what's happening yet. This dude could pop off. Again?! No, bro. Bro, I'm trying to find... 
stop that. Let's check out the rooms. Okay, we're all mine. But they literally put my name in the game, bro. Come on. I wouldn't do anything. Hey, see? See? I wouldn't do anything. Joseph Carlson. So we do get the name. Let's check cameras before. Yeah, I didn't. I'm gonna click the wrong button. Bro, is that because I'm using the cameras too much? Why does the lights keep going off? Stop that. Or is it just the game? I don't I don't know what that is. Check the rooms again. We have to. We didn't even die. Who so Oh my gosh. Can I just name is Copy this name because we we don't want to spend time just typing it out. That'll take way too long. Okay, we got we got the. Okay, we'll put that. So, just debit. And no no no, this. Police records. No police records. Then. And then what? Social spy. That's what we needed. What? The? What? What? We doing. Doing mad work, and then something's just shaking. Jeez, that actually scared me bad. So far, I haven't seen anybody. Maybe I will. Cameras, you know, see anybody there? Oh my god. Stop that. I think it is because I'm flashing the lights too much. That's why it's not happening. I don't know. Check all the rooms. This is about to be a long game. I'm about to play through night two and then maybe end the video. If I live. And we'll just try again. I can't tell if that's... Oh! Wait! There was someone there! Huh? Well, this is awkward. <laughs>
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want more of this, I can do more. Hit the like button.